Jim Jam biscuits after a very long time. And this is the pack. Jim Jam. So we are in the train and slightly disappointed because we didn't get the poop. But hopefully we get some good co-passengers and they are not the noisy types. Other than that, I'll show you what the cabin consists of. So there are four bulbs. This is seven and eight, and ours is nine and ten. We've kept our bedding ready because the train will depart at nine at eleven five, and then we should be sleeping soon. There are stairs over here to climb up to the top berth on both the sides. Someone's left their rubbish over there, and you get bedding which we have already used. And there are reading lights for the top berth as well as for the lower berth. A big window and a mirror. There's also a mobile charging point, switch for the light and oh, two charging points. There's privacy curtains as well as coat hooks. And I think this is for some type of announcement but I've never really heard an announcement in this train ever. Apart from the privacy curtain, there's also a sliding door which you can close the door. So there are three cabins over here. There's one coop and this side is the normal two tier. So this coach is a mixed coach of first class AC as well as two tier AC. We are in the mixed coach HA1 first class. Let's see how this journey goes. The train will depart at 11.05. It's going to be night time anyway. So there isn't much that I'm able to show you all. But early in the morning when there'll be a bit of daylight I'll be trying to get down at all the stations and capture whatever I can. Hope you enjoy this video and journey along with me. So the train has just departed. Departed around 5 or 10 minutes late. It's 11.20 right now. So not even 10 minutes late, it's 15 minutes late. Hopefully it reaches on time at Matgaon at 11.35 in the morning because it's monsoon timing right now, whereas the usual time is 10.45. I will keep you all updated 
let me see which stations I can get off and capture a few things and enjoy this journey with me. The train has reached the other station and there's nothing much to show because the lights are off in the cabin and that's about it. Let's see if there's anything exciting happening at the next station which is Thani. Good morning. We have reached Sangameshwar Road. We are one and a half hour late. It's 6.20 a.m. in the morning and it's raining. Just have a look. A lot of rain here and it's raining so much. We have a red signal. Probably there's a crossing of another train. You can hear some birds as well. So nice. This is at the end of the coach. There are two toilets on both sides, a wash basin, there's a fire extinguisher, hopefully we never need it, an emergency hammer and just the electricals for the AC. Going into my coach and I'll come back once again at the next station which is Ratnagiri. We have reached Ratnagiri station, it's one and a half hour late. There's already the yellow light given and we should be leaving soon, 7.15. The train is not too crowded now, a lot of other people as well. Pillow Bay Station still one hour late right now. It's breakfast time now and we've ordered Upma Shira. Opening it up and let's see. Wow, looks so nice. Let's taste test it. Hmm, nice and tasty. I always love the Upma Shira in the train and I'm going to enjoy it today as well. You can see we have reached Rajapur Road and it is raining so heavily.
very short haul at Vaibhavadi Road. We are still far away from Macau and we are already delayed. But all good, I'm enjoying it. Sindhudurg railway station. The rain has stopped but looks nice and peaceful. Started raining heavily. We've reached Santwadi with two hour delay. Santwadi is also the last stop in Maharashtra. And the next stop then will be the first stop in Goa. Welcome to Goa, the first stop in Goa. The train has stopped here for around 3 minutes right now when we just have a 2 minute hold. That's fine but it seems to be the hold is going to be much more longer because we are waiting for another train to pass by. Just have a look. So there's a red signal if I zoom in. You can see it's very blurred but then we'll have to wait till another train passes by from that side.
we have reached Tini, which is a very popular destination and stop for a lot of tourists coming to Goa. It's very close to Mapsa and a few other places. The train has started. Let me hop in. We've reached Karmali, which is also called as Old Goa. The famous Bomb Jesus Basilica is very close from the station over here. A lot of people get down over here as well. But then today, since it's raining and the train isn't like as filled up as it usually is, you can't really see much people. But anyway, I'm enjoying. However, it's already 12 p.m. right now, so I'm guessing by the time we reach Margao, it should be around 12.40 or 12.45, so a total delay of just over an hour. It's 1.5 p.m. and we are just about to reach Margam, a total delay of one and a half hour. Very tired, but I enjoyed the journey and I hope you all enjoyed as well. If you like this video, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends and family as well so that they can enjoy my adventures and you all can enjoy my adventures as well. Take care of yourselves and stay safe.